by players for players. Ever since the game of poker was invented some 200 years ago, some people have been looking for the highest game in the world. So what is the thrill of playing poker at ultra high levels? Apart from the possibility of winning enormous amounts of money, it is this challenge that very, very few people can handle that sort of pressure. It is one thing playing for pocket money. Trust me, it's quite another playing for stakes so high that you know that if you lose, you'll have to sell your car and your apartment and move in with your mother again. As the saying goes in poker, scared money always loses. But of course, the more money you have and the better you are at poker, the higher your comfort zone is, where you can still handle the pressure and play good aggressive poker instead of being so scared that you fold all the time. Professional players like Phil Ivey, Annie Duke, Ted Forrest, with their skills in deep pockets, they will have their comfort zones up at levels where you and I are afraid to go. But even the Las Vegas professionals have an upper limit to their comfort zone. The highest ever cash game in the world, $100,000, $200,000 limit, Texas Hold'em, took place in May 2004 when the Texas billionaire banker Andy Beal challenged a group of Las Vegas professionals led by none other than Doyle Brunson to a heads-up match. The bankroll required was so enormous that the Las Vegas professionals had to pool the resources to come up with enough money. And the result? For the first time in their lives, the Las Vegas professionals were taken out of their comfort zone in this game of $100,000, $200,000 limits. Think about it. The size of just a small blind was $50,000. That's more than two years' salary for the average European, and in every hand. So what happened? Well, the Texas billionaire Andy Beal, he had it figured correctly that even the Las Vegas professionals could be driven out of their comfort zones and up onto ultra levels where they would fear to play. So, Beal won the game, and not only that, he won more than anybody's ever won in a single day of poker before, $11.7 million. That still stands as the record for the highest poker game ever played. And with those words, I shall leave you for now. Good luck in those five and 10 euro sit and goes at Unibet, and I'll see you there. By players, for players.